Here is Knack Hill, the patch that Pebble calls home. Seems wowed that you made it all the way up here to wherever he happens to be. He's not quite sure about that himself, having gotten here accidentally. He was just passing through. The fact that he's no longer passing is where the accident comes in. He's bowled over by how you managed to find him. Someone who could do that could go just about anywhere. You seem solid, hard to crack, and always climbing higher. What could stop someone like that? Wherever you're heading next, he hopes you keep strong and tough. You'll need it to get through all the horrors of the world that lie ahead no matter which direction you go. Wants to know what you'd do if you made a mistake while trying to get someplace. Would you head back down and try again? Or would you try to continue on from where you were? Thinks he might just stay here forever instead. Says he's not sure he's happy about the world surviving. Means he's stuck here longer. Wonders why you tried to save the world. In the end, what's the difference? Curious about you working with the myriad. Don't all those lights they use hurt your eyes? Suppose that's great if there's something worth seeing. Let's talk about happier things. He says it's rare, but sometimes he gets caught between a rock and a hard place. There's no worse spot to be in, and this time is no exception. He's always felt insignificant, like a pebble to a mountain. That's why he's climbing now. He wants to feel on top of the lowlands for once. He realizes that one who doesn't climb can't fall either, so in a way, he guesses he's safer here, not going anywhere. Figures he's not as good a climber as he needed to be, at least at that moment. Pebbles risking death by staying or leaving, so he won't stop trying until he's able to climb out of this dying world. He figures he just has to be more careful. Also, it would be better if he knew where to climb. He doesn't want to be a pebble in your shoe, but if you'd help find some better spots for him to climb, he'd be really grateful. Thanks you for not just walking all over him when he's down. Getting brighter every time. Oh, no. Go look at yourself in a mirror. Can't. Everyone you looked in cracked. That was only one time. I have a shop full of shattered mirrors that says you're wrong. If the mount didn't throw you, you're good.
Time to ride. Everything is at stake. You've discovered Fanaki leaves, the densest jungle in the land. Better get hacking. Himatu Saina Tevele Manuya says they have a larger than life furry friend who made a terrible mistake. It wanted to take a bath to clean up. However, choosing a pool of grime slime to get the job done wasn't the brightest of ideas. Only a giant brush will make it clean. Isn't sure, but you can probably hear him whine. <laughs> 
if you get close enough. Maybe smell the slime? Claims you won't have to look too hard to find the gum brush. Once you do, get back to their friend fast. Just be sure to brush them good. Thinks a friend could have no better friend. Supposedly amounts like that. One kind of scrap you could actually still find growing. Pebble says he feels much better now that he knows where to go and promises to give the new spots you found a go. Pebble's been putting his life on the line for too long and would feel better if you had time to help him balance that out. He understands the line between life and death is wearing thin, but he believes there must be a way to overcome that. He's ready to cross the line, but he just needs your help to tell him which way to go. If you'd help find some ropes that are tight enough to hold him, he'd be really grateful. 
Thanks you for guiding him toward finding his own way. Pebbles right here, for now. Wishes you goodbye.